everybody in there. A one, a two, two a one, one, two, two three, three, and what's going on, JS Go One? We are back at it again with a brand new video. Okay, hola, como estas and all things of that nature. My name is Jared. You already know who it is. <laughs> And it's like, <laughs> it's your homegirl, Sable. So today we thought we'd bring you guys a beautiful fruit mukbang fruit because we, we have not eaten so all day. I am very hungry, naranja. so this is going to be a meringue, a, a, a what? Mango. Nara? This is not naranja. This isn't, this isn't orange. Yes, that's orange. No, it's, it's baby not. orange. This is, this it's is little not, naranja. It's a tangerine. It's little naranja. We have this watermelon. Is, this is, a, is this a tangerine or is this an orange? It's Please baby, tell me in the comments yeah, below. Look, it's little, not even doing it. <laughs> tangerines are just baby oranges, but we have um, here today a very LA based frutas um, mukbang. We have our chamoy, and we also have Bolt House here. Yeah, we sponsor my bajos. No, we not sponsor. No, we bajos. are not. We aren't, but we just really like the drink. So we're about to drink that and eat that. And today's topic of discussion is I am. I'm what? Station. Oh, let's take a bite and then we'll get into that because I feel like here, pour your stuff up. I'm gonna try. There's a lot of tea, so we're gonna pour our bolt house and we are going to get into it. It's very scrumptious too. Mm. How was that first bite? Really good. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. So this right now is the pineapple. The way I cut it up is a little bit more like chopped, just because. I wanted to preserve the pineapple. This green goodness top. tastes healthier than usual. Like it's usually more sweet. Yeah. There's not to make it more healthier. Mm-hmm. Mm. So let's just get into it. So what's going on with this whole J Station, my girlfriend passed away situation like? I mean, you saw it. We're watching it in the store. What do you mean you don't know what's going on? Like, you're well, saying- I wanna know. Is let, let me just what say what is your perspective on this whole No, I have a lot to say, but I'm just because. saying I don't think I don't think any of us truly know. Cause you guys, the last thing that I heard was that he melt he posted a video that he was getting arrested because the girl wanted him to take down the videos, but then he came out with evidence that the videos were faked for views and to get him to a million subscribers, which, listen, I don't mind his fake 3 a.m. videos. None of that, I don't care, because at the end of the day, it's entertainment, and it's interesting to watch. But I feel like when you're talking about someone's life, like how he did the XX XXTentacion um, videos and stuff like that, somebody said he was gonna do a LeBron James video and then he tweeted no, like he was going to do a Kobe Bryant well he was video. like well he was like don't worry he was like don't worry you guys like I'm not I'm not gonna end up doing it so he ended up not doing it he was it. going to do the Kobe Bryant video because Kobe Bryant passed away but he decided that he wasn't gonna do it because of everything that was going on yeah sorry you guys our camera just died so we are gonna get right back into it's what we were fault. saying it's you always fault. gotta always gotta charge your batteries anyway multiple what were you saying about jay station yeah so basically he tweeted that he wasn't gonna do the kobe bryant right. passing Which, away video thank because god he does it for every single celebrity that passes away he did it for mac miller he did it for xx tentacion he's done it Attica. to so many yeah. he did it to avici too right he it's just like the list goes on and on and oh right? yeah yeah. Is it like contacting, how's it go? Like contacting, contacting the dead or something? Yeah, contacting Mac Miller. At 3 a.m. At 3 a.m. And then he he did one where it was like reviving people from dead. I don't know. I'm Listen, I'm a horror bluff. Like I love dark horror films and all that stuff. But I feel like there's just some things that you really do not play with if right. it is truly about somebody who really passed away. Like that yeah. is so crazy. Like do that. Oh, you want to? Let's try that together. Let's try that together. Uh, I don't know if Hold I can on. wait. I yep. really don't. Well, okay, I'll wait. You're gonna wait. Woo! Okay. You, See, I'm gonna put a lot. a lot. Well, because I knew it was gonna drip down to others. Right. So then we do so, it. So. Okay. Are you ready? Well, hold on. Then we'll get back into that. You. Oh yeah. Cheers. Yours is the juicy one. Cheers. Here we go. Mmm. 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 Wow. Wow. You know what's crazy? Our mukbangs have come such a long way. We used to literally hate the food. 
now it's like oh when we when we were doing like the whole frying we were frying oreos that no that was were actually really good we made some really really disgusting hot cheeto chicken no, yeah the oreos were good i actually kept it was eating the chicken though. because i feel like we undercooked the chicken otherwise mm. it would have been really good we should have actually put it in the fryer mm -hmm. mm. 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 okay sorry we lost our train of thought this watermelon is so good i need more this chamoy mm. but here's the thing about j station i honestly i get the hustle I get the grind. I get it because I feel like he got his channel demonetized. YouTube had this whole censorship thing on the um, website. And I understand I've been on YouTube for over 10 years. So I understand like the changes on the site and everything going on with it. But I just think that there's something to be said about, you know, the way he goes about it. And, and like from from what I've seen with the videos, because I don't really watch the ones where he mm. he he calls on to like dead celebrities. I don't do that, but yeah. he does he does keep it respectful if that's what you want to call it mm -hmm. for that type of video. But it's just still it's very weird. It's a it's a gray area with that. Yeah, but I see a lot of people coming at him for like faking his three AM videos. It's like okay, well you think Paranormal Activity the movie is real, like. It's entertainment. Mm -hmm. I think, personally, I think his videos are entertaining. I just think people don't like him. So I think they nitpick on the small things. Like, oh, he says guys a lot. I see that as a big complaint. And I'm yeah. like, it's YouTube. Phase run. Everybody says, you guys, you got, like, it's an expression. You guys, I think, yes, we should We're hold him. We're from California. I say yeah. like literally all the time. And he's from Canada. So he, you know, says A and, you know. But I, I think that what we should hold him accountable for, though, is this. I personally... Me personally, I think he went too far with this. Mm -hmm. Because now you're getting law enforcement involved. And the only reason, like you said in the car, that I think that he decided not to, um, uh, what do you, uh, do the LeBron James, uh, I mean, LeBron James. Keep saying LeBron James. LeBron, because Kobe you Bryant. remember they ran stories saying it was, they, they were saying Kobe Bryant, but they were putting LeBron James pictures. Yeah. When I first they woke were. up. They were. Did you, so you saw that too? Yeah, yeah. it was crazy. I'm like. So, he wanted so to do sad. that, Kobe, but he just knew it was too much drama for him. But well, he was also probably being arrested at that time. That's my theory on it. If he is arrested, we have to look because I couldn't find any arrest records. I just, my whole thing about it is that... the police came to his house. I felt like him and Alexia were in on whatever they had going on because I saw her video that she just posted 20, like, 24 hours ago probably now. And it just seemed as like she was talking about all of the abuse that J Station did to her, which I I don't know if I agree or disagree, but there has been other girls who have came out about J Station abusing them and being very like mean and oh you know, yeah, like that young girl crazy in the relationship. Yeah, well, was it Kiko? Oh, Kiko. I remember her. I remember her too. It's crazy how like yeah, Kyoko so or something. Ago. Yeah, what happened to her? I don't know. J Station has always been really. Mm, mm. He's been in those situations before. Oh my god! I just put chamoy in my. You put it in my hair? Oh. Beanie. <laughs> you know what though? Let me say something. Ooh. I have a theory, right? So he did come out, you guys, and say we had planned the videos and all this stuff. But I guess I'm just a little bit confused at the fact that if. Okay, let's say you're, what's the girl's name? I, which one, the new one? Uh, yeah. Alexia. So let's say you're Alexia. Me and you agree, we're gonna fake my own death and you're gonna get a million views and I'll take some money off the back end, 20% or whatever. Obviously, he's, you should, right? Because he's the one bringing that fan base to light even though she'd be the face of that channel. It's like Jake, uh, Jake Paul and Yeah, Erica Jake Paul does Stella. it. It's a standard contract. Yeah. My thing is, was it because she couldn't take the fame or is it because they took it too far? Because I remember Jay Station saying in his video, which we don't really know, none of us will know the truth until he, we have evidence, but he said in his video, you have chamoy all over your mouth. He said in his video, um, no, it's all over your mouth. Um, he said in his video that, um, oh, the girl, like she, he, he said that she called the police telling, or basically asking her, he was, she was asking him to take down the videos. And if he did not take down the videos, then she was going to call the police. And then he said, oh, 
I didn't think that she was going to go through right. with what she said. But my thing is, if you're in this for money, fame, and subscribers, taking J Station out of this, why would you call the police and mess up your own situation? That doesn't think, make sense. I think she agreed to something that she actually could not handle. Bingo! She agreed to something that she couldn't handle. Bingo! And J Station was okay with getting hate mm -hmm. for faking used to her, it. her death because he's used to it. Everybody already hates him. Well, and there will be a new scandal with involving him the next day because he's J Station. Well, he, hold on. It's controversial. I'll take it a step further and say he warned her. I was yeah. like, dude, you, we can do this? And any, you can do your research and your history on Jay Station. Yeah. I, like, refuse to believe that this Alexia oh, girl... Wow. Try the oranges in it. I mean, Ooh. the chandra. Oh, I have to. I'm going to do that right mm. after I say this. Let me get this thought out. Let me see. I, ble I believe that this Alexia girl, she does not... She she knew what she was getting into because she... You you can research Jay, Jay Station because she said the first time that they met... She said that he was Listen. weird, he was creepy. Listen. You know that he's a public figure. There's so many reports and scandals that he's been involved with. I'm not even going to give her that because we don't know whether she's smart, dumb. We really don't know, right? You never really know what you're getting yourself into until you do it. Because I warn yeah. people all the time That's about true. this YouTube game. And they think they're going to get on here and just blow up like Emma Chamberlain. It's like, no, you do have to follow trends. You do have to do certain things to get ahead on YouTube. We get that. So people will come on here and get discouraged after a couple months because they're trying to upload what they want. I'm, like, I'm not getting any views. It's like, it's not about you. It's about this algorithm that you have to cater to. Mm. So he probably warned her about all this I'm stuff. And it's like, off the plate. he probably warned her about all this stuff. And she was like, why? Ooh, this is so juicy. Everything. I, I can do it, and I can do this, and I can do that. And it got too real for her. And didn't you read a report saying that her dad was like, when the videos were going up, was like, I didn't even want to watch it. But didn't he know it was happening? So he knew the truth. But he was just like, yeah, I'm not going to watch that. Like, yeah. my daughter being, whether it's real or fake yeah. or not, and whether I know it, like, you're presenting it to the world yeah. as this. J Station has a large fan base of... Uh, I, don't, I don't think she knew it was going to get this big. Young people. But... I don't get when people say that because you can okay, literally yeah, look. Yeah, that's no. There, like I said, there is evidence that shows that J Station's past has been very shady. Okay, but but <laughs> to the extent, okay, H three has reported on it. How many people? I know never. Penguin. Penguin. A penguin. Uh, I feel like PewDiePie has definitely said something. If not, he's saying it in private. It's, it's like I feel like yeah. everyone has said something about. I'm Jay Station. Yeah, it's like point. almost overpowering the not the not the death of Kobe Bryant, but the on YouTube, this is like the biggest YouTube scandal that's happening right now where it's just making yeah. like Yeah. Because no one has ever done that before. That's really, yeah, really like, crazy to do. Just to fake somebody's death. Personally, okay. Here's how I yeah. feel about it too. And I will say this. I feel like YouTube likes to pick and choose. Yeah. When they get involved and when they don't, right? Like, what was her name who had the uh, anorexia issue? Uh, what, what was I it? know who you're talking about. Yeah. What What was her name? I forgot her I name. I forgot her name, too. But I Shane, think she's still alive. Though. Shane, yeah. yeah she, she, still Shane alive. did a whole thing about her or whatever. They never took her channel down. And I feel like she was promoting anorexia, promoting... Uh, bulimia, eating disorders, showing off her bones and, and things like that, right? There was petitions, yeah. people, to get Oh my god, her. I know. I, I have friends who have anorexia and literally yeah. would tell me. I'm like, oh, they would send me a or they'll be like, oh my god, I want her body. I'm like, what? Yeah, because it's triggering yeah. you to say, oh, I want to go back, or maybe I'm yeah. fat, because that's the standard. It's of, really sad. And, and it's sad. you're getting validation from it, right? Well, even in that stance, the girl's mom was saying how... Didn't I don't think she wanted her to be on there no. either. Yeah. So it was really a shame. But you but she can't really you can't really control it. Yeah, adult. sad. You can't control it. Because I remember I, she And she's very her. sweet. I actually met her no, like nice. in two thousand and twelve at like right, a I remember old that. VidCon. And she was, you know, skinny back mm -hmm. then and stuff, but she's very sweet. I, I don't think she deserves the hate on the internet, she but doesn't. I do think in that case her channel should have been shut down yeah. personally by YouTube. Yeah, right? and I hope that like now that she's getting help, I hope that like she changes her channel into like a anorexia recovery or something. Phase, yeah. yeah, more positive. We'll see. But that just goes down to even J Station. 
YouTube has demonetized him once. He thought it was a personal attack. Listen, we got demonetized. People are getting demonetized left and right. Our whole channel was demonetized. He ended up getting his monetization back. YouTube does not care. So when you guys are like up in arms over something that YouTube doesn't even want to step in and care about, it doesn't, it, 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 let, he's going to make his money. He's going to keep making his money. So I don't really. I'm not mad at him. I'm not. I can understand why people who watch YouTube who are fans of him are mad because that is disappointing to see. But it is what it is. I don't he's gonna continue doing it. He's not gonna stop. I feel like Jay Station, even if his channel did get demonetized, he's gonna create another one. Yeah, well he did. The, I'm Jay Station is yeah. the new one. He he has quite a few, right? But here's my thing, right? I am mad at the situation. I'm not mad at him yeah. because I respect Jay Station as a hustler. Yeah, me too. I do. You, nobody is paying his bills but him. So at the end of the day, whatever he does, he's not necessarily hurting anybody. In a way, he is because he's kind of affecting the lives of people. And a lot of people are, like, really confused by a lot of this. <laughs> but I respect the hustle. I just wish that... It's almost like, okay, right? Philly, Philly D, right? Very, yeah, very respected D. on YouTube. A lot of you guys don't remember Sexy Phil, though. I came from the first generation of YouTube. This is a new channel, me and my sister's channel, but we remember because she used to help me when I just had my solo channel. But I came from the, uh, the early generation of YouTube where you wouldn't like Philly De Philly Philip DeFranco if you knew what his old content mm -hmm. used to be. Exploiting women, uh, thumbnails with uh, breasts and all this stuff in it. And yeah, he had, it looked like porn ads. It, yes, right? Yeah. Look at Shane Dawson. So I'm saying I get it, but my and that that's my thing is now that J Station has the platform of over five million subscribers, you can still do your horror content. We don't care about the mm -hmm. fake 3 a.m. videos and I ordered a fake uh, clown from the dark web. We don't care about any of that. But why can't you just tweak your content just a little bit so that these scandals stop happening because I feel like you have a wide you you have a wide enough audience now to where they're gonna keep watching whatever you do. He's almost like he's making videos at the level of someone who is just clawing for attention and, and asking fa for yeah. fame. It's like you already have that. So just tweak it a little bit. I mean Philly D made it work. Shane Dawson's doing documentaries. And I think now. that people will forget about all of this. Oh yeah. Because anyway any scandal can get erased. I mean the fa just look it at Jeffree can. Star. Yeah, Jeffree Star, Shane Dawson with blackface. There, I mean, there's so many people who have recovered from scandals. So yeah. It's it's just yeah. something that I, I don't know. Maybe he just likes the, the infamy. Mm -hmm. Well, Azalea it. Banks does. So there's people who you can tell. Like you can tell, like Jeffree Star, certain people like that do not like scandals. No. <laughs> wow. Jay Station loves a good scandal. Right. And it's like, is he in hiding? Where is he right now? I don't know, but it's really crazy. I don't think I really have much mango. The mango is good. Mmm. 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 That's so delicious. I am You didn't cool. try any of the, the, um, up here? The, the oranges? Tangerine. The tangerine? I'm going to try one. Mmm. Mmm. Wow, the raspberries are so good, you guys. Well, mm. you guys. That is where we're going to end the video here. Um, this was so good. We're going to come back so and do tasty. more of these mukbangs. You said you guys like them. Because I like to eat. Sorry that this one was a little bit longer than usual, but... someone we in the comments, a lot to talk yeah, about. Yeah, and someone in the comments so literally said, we don't care, like, do a 30-minute one, you know? Mm -hmm. Beloved does, like, hour-long ones and stuff. And An it, hour, 30 People minutes. really like watching people talk kind of like a podcast. So right. this is basically, you guys, our podcast until... We get our we get actual podcast, comment. right? Because this is our biggest platform. So thank you guys so much for watching. Leave your comments in the uh, below in Turn the description. Turn on those post notifications and to subscribe all. if you were new to this channel. Channel. Um, first five comments on every single video get a post notification shout out. Today's post notification shout outs will be brought up all right mm. now from the last video. Mm. So the post notification shout out from the last video, we're going to do D'Angelo again. I know we give you a... Um, Post notification shout out. It's Jen. And 
Let's get Sammy Stover. <laughs> Thank you so much for being subscribed to the channel and commenting and liking all the time. We really appreciate all that. We love We're going to take over this YouTube game. That's what we're we here to do. We're taking over this YouTube period. game. Period. Mamba mentality. R.I.P. Kobe. Rest in peace, Kobe that. Bryant. Um, until next time, peace, peace. love, and abundance, abundance of joy.